So today not only marks Martin Luther King Day here in Illinois, but it also recognizes the first ever Muhammad Ali Day. Governor Pritzker signed a resolution last year adding Ali's birthday, January 17th, to the list of the state's commemorative school holidays. Joining us now to talk about it is Maria Mozafar, Director of Policy and Advocacy for the Illinois Muslim Civic Coalition. Thanks for doing this. Thank you so much for having me. I'm excited. So I wanted to ask you how this came to be. I was reading about you and your organization. You're an attorney, so you drafted this legislation. We know he was born in Kentucky, but of course had deep ties here. So how did this all start? Well, the reality is we wanted to think about legislation that would impact uh, the state as a whole and would uplift inspirational voices. And we thought Muhammad Ali, America's champ, uh, is someone that's loved by all. And we also believe that America's champ is somebody that was a proud African-American Muslim. And so to create a legislation coming out of the Illinois Muslim Civic Coalition, it was very, very fitting to, to do that today. Let's assume there are folks watching right now that only know Muhammad Ali for his boxing exploits. What would the one thing be that you would like them to know about Muhammad Ali outside of the ring? I would like them to know that he was much more than his boxing. He was actually a symbol of uh, truth and an advocate of social justice that stood on principle. He stood strongly against the Vietnam War. He had a global following because he reached out to people of all backgrounds and all races, and uh, he was considered a hero for, for being authentically himself. And he was inspiring to so many people and reminded them that they should be the best that they can be. So, Maria, tell us that how exactly is the state honoring Muhammad Ali today? Well, uh, January 17th is his birthday, which is why it was uh, chosen for it to be today. It happens to be on the same day as MLK Day this year. And we actually, the Illinois Muslim Civic Coalition, hosted a deliberate dialogue in which we had uh, powerful speakers talk about his example. And then throughout the state, actually, people have been downloading toolkits. Educators have been... Uh, um, given toolkits to teach students and have conversations within communities and families of why Muhammad Ali was so, so powerful. And we also feel that this is just the first year. So now we're going to see this happen every year on January 17th, and people are going to remember and glorify him in many, many ways. They've, there have been over 4,000 posters distributed uh, by, by uh, individuals where students and families have, have taken them and put them in their hallways at school. So we're very, very excited. That's great. Well, as Ali used to say, the greatest of all time. <laughs> and it's great to see some of the video just to the left of the screen there, too, yeah, bringing yeah, back a lot of wonderful memories. Maria, thank you so much for your time and uh, being with us today. We appreciate it. You're very welcome and honored. Thank you.